does not go again. And the pitch in the dirt. Now he goes. The ball went off the shoulder or somewhere of JT. And JT's in a lot of pain. Oh, he's wobbling. Wow. Oh, a gun a minute. Comebacker off Wilson to tumbles. Can't find the ball. And he's limping visibly. Oh, no. That's a spot that will make your. You know, it, it'll shoot the nerves down into your. Marte and Freeman hit as Alvarez trickles one up the line. Pouncing on this. Smith and he throws it away. Alvarez will go to second. Sliding after it is Kike Hernandez. His throw is not in time. Good hustle by Alvarez. Popped him up. Devers and Rafaela out. Coming on O'Neill. And a collision. Oh my. Rafi went down. O'Neill. Mancata down that third base line. Tough play. Oh. Kata goes down, and you can tell he is in pain. Pedro Grafal told the media today. Yes, unfortunately, Jacob Junis was hit in the back of the neck during batting practice by a ball. He was out doing some conditioning. He's been working his way back from a shoulder injury, but good news for him. He was he was alert. He was responsible. Oh, that plucked him. Right on the hands. And the bases are loaded. The tying run comes to the plate in the form of a Rosarena. 99 miles an hour. Oh, man. With a strikeout, Estrada on the move. Yastrzemski reaches out, pokes it off. Nelly will check on Ryan Nelson, oh. who's doubled over here in front of the Diamondback dugout, holding his right wrist. And he is immediately going in to get looked at by Max Esposito. In the air, Morrell out. Canario. Oh, look out, fellas. Christopher came down with it, and he is in some pain. Yeah, this is not a good. One, two, broken back ground ball hit to third. They will get one. Throw to first. Not in time. Sanchez beat it out. Is he all right? Looks like he was uh, hopping as he hit the bag over there. A hamstring maybe hold. The 0 one from Jelly, and that's going to drill him. Garrett Cooper hit by the pitch and in some pain. Just joined the Red Sox, and here he is in agony. And gripping the wrists. Garcia. Uh oh. Mm. Lucero out quickly. Head athletic trainer. You take a look. You hate it when you see these coming in near the hands and wrists, especially when a guy. And that's a fair ball down the left field line. Margot will score. Uh oh. Lewis is held by Tommy Watkins, but Lewis is limping as he rounded third base. That turn at second looked like maybe he. Oh. And that hit him on the hand. A fastball at 94 hits him on the hand. Did not look pleasant. No, not at all. Second you could hear it. You better. could hear it when it hit him up there. But Black. Oh, look out! Torres had no way of getting out of the way. So while the Yankees training staff tends to Torres, the Astros have seen enough. No, they're going to make a change here. That's Jemai. Jem Easy take. And here comes the top of the order. His back? I don't know. I mean, we just hope it's not the elbow. He's already had Tommy John on it, and he waves him out. So he knows it's something that's going to get him. Ooh. Uh oh. That hit Marsh. And still gets the out at first base. Oh, no. And he's hobbling and now throws his glove. That's his pitching hand. It was about three quarters away. Yeah. yeah. I didn't even see the throw. I was just trying to make the first. Frustration, anger, mad, any any of those adjectives you want to use. That's one of the most frustrating parts, right? Is. Bouncer back toward the middle, should be two. Stott will step on the bag and comfortably throw it to first. And the inning is over. Ortiz picks up Nola here in the fifth. This is the last pitch that Ortiz threw. And Sitting in up above so they could get that shot. I see. Yeah. Two and one on Polanco. Single pop out fly out. Uh, they're I think come, we can attack on, Spilly. Hold on, they're coming out to take a look at Noah Davis. He towns. Here's what happened in case you didn't see. You'll see right there was Nick Martini in the cage. It was an odd situation and he went down in a heap and it hit interesting enough right on the. And that's hit to left field and Melendez makes the catch. Here's a tag by Marte. Here's the throw. Took the spikes. That was a tough day at the ballpark yesterday with TJ Antone left. 
what appeared to be another elbow injury and we got the news today that we pretty much expected the tendon torn away from the bone also his ligament up the middle Harvey oh, no. we hope he's OK I mean we could hear that up here and they're coming out of the Nats dugout the infield's going to gather around and then Ooh, that got CB Buckner boy did it ever he hit him directly and Jose Ministral the Blue Jays trainer is going to there's McGuire a single and a strike oh. all got him picked. Valdez is trying to get to second. Nobody covering second, but the tumble and Sano tags him out. I don't like the way he fell on that wrist. Somewhere in the neighborhood of six months. Um, you know, again, uh, difficult to, to speculate specifically beyond that. Um, but you know, you can kind of do do the math there. Very significant. Um, you know. Back back off of Snyder. It drops him. The ball goes into foul territory. Everybody is safe, and the concern now is for Snyder. Man, he was smoked. Looked like it hit him right on his shin. Luis Robert Jr. lines this one to left, and it gets down. It'll go all the way to the wall. Oh, no! No! Robert comes up gimpy. We've already. This will get one run in. Volpe gobbles it up. Wild oh, throw, and Rizzo can't hang on. Perdomo heads for second. He's limping in there. Something's wrong with Domo. And that's the tying run. It's a one run game. What? As now we get a visit to the mound, and this is not good. Jacob Newburn is an athletic trainer coming out there. I love the trainers. They do a great job. You just don't like to see him coming out onto the field because they know that if you grip. Wow. It's Kepler. Drops to a knee. <laughs> Old trainer Dave Prumer used to tell me if you need more than two ice bags, you just got to get in the ice. That went to Oregon State. Pretty good. No push bunt here. Steele gloved it and oh. flipped it in time. Boy, a snow cone. And this is bad news. Steele is down. Grab. Off the end of the bat. Popped up outside of first. Harper is over. And oh, man, look out. Holy cow. He didn't know where the railing was. He flipped over onto the camera well. The joke. Well, swung out of his shoes there, fouled back. And didn't like the reaction at all there from Sean Murphy. Uh oh. And both just hit him. Trying to get that slider on the back foot, and he got it on the back foot all right. And he put Seeger on. In the air out towards left center. Bellinger on the move, crossing back. Cody, oh, it's off his glove. Got it. No. Nope. Yeah, but it was off the That's wall. The ball too, I thought, yeah, then maybe got it. So the run. It's little things there, Dan. Lane takes off. Throw down by Smith, tails into the runner. Ooh. And Lane Thomas. Ooh. Is he hurt? Yeah. Oh, no. Toss. He gets the out with that awkward toss. Is he okay? David Bell immediately emerges over to third when Hicks. Ground ball up the middle trickles to Julian. He'll field fire and get Gio Urshela by half a step at first. Well, Ryan Eubank out to walk back to the dugout with Gio Urshela. It's always something you think of. 3 1 filed away. Sox with 28 home runs, number two in Major League Baseball. It's their most through 21 games since 2002. So something. No balls, two strikes. Offers it that and fouls it off. He hits the baseball off his leg. He's got hit by a pitch. And I wonder if something happened to his wrist on that swing. We've certainly seen this before. I'll show you what we may have picked up on. You don't want to make too much of it. But this was on the burger ground ball in the first. And he kind of grabs that left side a little bit. Saw that go in a break and then watched him. The one two pitch. Strike three called. He's not back out defensively with his half inning. Yeah, a little check swing. That's oblique territory. First in from the bullpen is TJ Antone. And it certainly is nice to see Antone. Well, that's not good. The, oh, boy. He immediately went to his elbow. Base. Oh yeah. A shot to right. 
Lipscomb scores. Here comes Garcia. The throw is late. Everybody moving up. Well, Paul Lassard and Daniel Martinez are on the way to third base to see what's up with Victor Rope. And there's a pitch coming in. And he swung at that pitch. Look at that. He gets hit in the forearm, and because he went around, he's going to get called for a strike. Flores will come over and he will reach in and go into the dugout. And they're asking for help. Crowded left side, Urshela has time. And Jimenez is thrown out at first. Looks like Eloy's got himself a sore leg. Eloy was running like he was.